Uh, my name is Robinson Prime. Optimus. Um, Prime time. Um, as, as a pastor's son, I was exposed to Christianity at an early age over the years. Um, I had accumulated biblical knowledge about Christianity and used that as my foundation for claiming to be a Christian. I had a form of godliness but denied its power. Um, I, I drew near to Christ with my mouth and honor him with my lips, but my heart was far from him. Consequently, everything I had done in the church, from teaching Sunday school to playing music, was done for my own glory, to show what I can do, rather than glorifying God for what Christ had done. I moved to the United States back uh, from Haiti back in 98, uh, and met my wife uh, at a local church back then. Uh, we both thought we had to be Christians since both of our parents were actively involved in the church and yet our lifestyle proved the opposite. I was baptized a year later at the age of 15, uh, thinking then that my baptism had definitely made me holier. I'm eternally grateful to God for not putting me to sleep then, as I would have awakened in the flames of hell for my hypocrisy and ignorance of the gospel of Jesus Christ. Around 2008, I was invited to Cornerstone through my brother-in-law and uh, sister-in-law, Lillian West, um, and began to hear the gospel in its rare form. I had always thought I kept the Ten Commandments since I was a very nice guy. Um, and subsequently, without saying out loud, that I really didn't have the need for Christ. But I was quickly reminded every time my wife would play sermons that were preached the previous Sunday uh, in the house on purpose out loud so I can hear. Um, throughout that process, I uh, had multiple conversations with brothers like Dale, uh, Tom Matugi, who broke down John 316 for me. Um, and throughout that process and throughout that time, Christ began to expose my sins and God's law became a mirror to me and I didn't like what I saw. It bothered me that I, although I had been in the church all my life, and yet I was spiritually lifeless. But because of God's grace through Jesus Christ and through the faithful preaching of his word, he raised me up from the dead and caused me to true repentance and faith in Christ. Because of what Jesus Christ had done on the cross, I can now say that he has saved me and has given me a new life. And the old things have passed away and, all, and now all things have been made new. So for those of you who may be listening today and have not repented, uh, today is the day of salvation. Uh, and Jesus Christ is the only way of salvation because Jesus Christ himself said he is the way, the truth, and the life. And no one comes to the Father except through him. Amen.